everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Anissa and don't forget to like subscribe comment share and ring the bell everything I'm going to be linked to down below in the description and let's get right into this so I will be doing a bomb nails you can kind of see it right here it was kind of rubbed off but a bomb nails um, Halloween bundle collection um, swatching and unboxing and review um so if you enjoyed that then keep on watching so let's get right into it i cut off all the tape already like a long time ago hopefully the smoke detector doesn't beep anymore i am so sorry i'm gonna talk like up here so hopefully if it does beep it's like not that loud but here's the box and here's some like glitter on top i don't know if it's supposed to be there but it's there and it comes with the little bubble wrap and then the orange um, tissue paper. The other one, the fall one had, the fall one had um, like the little fall leaves on it. And then this one, because it is the Halloween one. Um, if you read the description of my other video of my fall bundle one, I said it was coming. So here it is. And there is some um, little Halloween glitters in here. There's a pumpkin, a cat, and the purple crinkle paper and then there's some bats some spider webs and on the side here and on the side here we have some halloween foil which is literally just all the spooky stuff so the pumpkins uh the cats the witches the all that type of stuff and this is foils then we have some pumpkin stickers and some skulls and the little graveyard scene the black cat happy halloween cat um witch's hat the little church thing the little church thing and in this bag which is interesting there's some dangles right here i'm not gonna open it because if i open it it'll like fly out but it's in a resealable bag so we have two gold dangle charms right here two dangles um two big huge charms and in this one we have some little they look to be like they look to be like the paper like glitter things and it's pink with white detailing and it has like the hearts has spider webs bats all that and then this is like the scary version of it and so it has like the black the orange the white um ghost bats all that and this is just the pink version of that so yes very very cute and then there's some and these are flipped there's a pumpkin in here uh a ghost this is like um to be hello kitty this looks to be hello kitty and then this one is a spider web comes with a lot of nail art accessories um the other one did and so did this one um, this is very very cute and I like the addition of the dangle charms and the like the actual putting in of like the actual like hoop that you need so this was very very thoughtful very very kind and then we have these acrylics there's glitter and some solids in here I will show you guys them but this is everything that comes in the um, Halloween bundle um, so and I will tell you the price after the swatches and these these lids are changed for halloween which is really really cute like the sticker it has the spider web the spider the boo and it's very very cute so i will be back and set up for swatches so i'm going to start off by swatching the the mats so i'm gonna start with this orange which is like a fluorescent orange color and this is one of, oh, it has a little shimmer in it. Yes, it has like a t the tiniest bit of shimmer. This is the Young Nails Artistic Sculptor Brush and this is JC Beauty Concepts Monomer. I 
I like this, but I feel like there's like, yeah, you can see it in the powder, how there's like a layer of glitter and then there's like a layer of like orange. So you just have to make sure you like mix that properly. And I'm just gonna clean off my brush really quick. Actually, I'm just gonna do another bead up here to kind of fill this area in. But yes, here this color is, and it is called Halloween. So it's like an orange with a little bit of glitter in it. I didn't know it had glitter in it. But yes, very cute. And this is what it looks like in the jar. So what I'm noticing so far is this is a very glitter heavy um, collection. And this also has shimmer in it, I believe. This is the green. Yeah, it has a little bit of shimmer in it too, but this one didn't um, separate like the orange did. And it's not even like a real, like it's not even like a real separation. It's just kind of like the glitter pulls apart a little bit, but it's kind of what glitter does. So this is Frankenstein. So I would just give the, um, this orange one a shake, but it seems to be, yeah, as it's drying, it's fine. And like you can clearly see the, the glitter running throughout. So again, that one is Frankenstein. So now onto the black. I probably should have swatched the black first because the black looks like uh, totally matte versus these that have a little bit of glitter running throughout. But we'll see. My, my brush has no glitter in it. Yup. So it is just a matte black. And this is called Edward Scissorhands. like gorgeous this is like the whole reason why i opened up this pot this um box because i knew this black was in here and uh today is thursday and i do have a client coming tomorrow so she wants her nails all black and i wanted to use this black because you guys see me use the model ones like every single time i do, do black but she dropped one so I might as well use hers because I love her consistency and all that. I love the model ones as well, but I just want to, her formula is just very, very, very good. And I know like you are going to need very little of that black. You're gonna need very little of that black if you're gonna work very, very wet. And you, well not even very, very wet, but like you see how it like spread out right here. That could like spread across the entire nail like you don't need to do this very thick at all because you're gonna have to encapsulate like regardless so now we have the glitters and that's my monitor this is Boogeyman. Actually, no. Out of the glitters, do I swatch Heavenly first before I swatch the glitters or last? Let's, let's do last, so you can under so you can get like the full collection without me interrupting. So this is a clear glitter mix with orange, black, and like a blue iridescent 
brief lift in it. Gorgeous. Let me give it a swatch. Ooh. And these are all, as you can see, pre-mixed. So as you can see, these are all pre-mixed glitters. And this one again is called Boogeyman. Very cute. And it's orange and black, um, different sizes. And there's like the hexagonal um, glitter in there as well. So there is one that is the shimmer. I probably should have just washed it with the other ones, but it's okay. This is called Tiffany. Oops. And these are all one ounce acrylics, by the way. And in the fall collection, there was um, a line of glitters. And I didn't get those glitters just because I have like a ton of her glitters, even though these are all different. But I didn't know if I was going to use those glitters, really. Like, and they, they're $70. And I probably should have bought them. I still can. But I was just thinking about it. Like, should I get them and swatch them just so I can have them? Because people really do want like... Um, fall glitters and all that and that would be like a really good thing to purchase and by the way if you guys by the way if you guys have not subscribed to bomb Nose channel go ahead and subscribe to her um, her link will be in the cards and this is gorgeous it's like purple with like um, hollow glitter running throughout very cute and this is definitely a shimmer so it's just like the other one that was in the fall but the the fall was um, brown and gold and that one was Tiffany this one is scream and I know scream is a movie i know that there's like a couple screens and i'm pretty sure there's like a new screen coming out or something like that um i might watch it i might not i don't know and this is like gorgeous like this could have also been named like spider something because like the red and the black i don't know it always just gives spider to me i don't know why that is and again it has that blue well a little bit of blue not too much like not like this one not like the um boogeyman one but like a little tiny bit of blue maybe but it's red and black and white glitter pieces and i'm not really like well, it depends what kind of premix glitter it is, but I really enjoy her premix glitters. The first couple beads of like any premix, the first couple beads of any premix glitter, um, to me are kind of like difficult to pick up. Like you can't really get in there like you want to. Like it picks up kind of like weird and kind of dry. But after you get through that that first initial layer. And you can really get your brush in there then it kind of gets good and as you can see i clipped the nails down um as you can see there's my grow out and it was growing really really long and it was getting harder and it was getting harder to type so i cut that down this is scream and this is also one ounce these are all one ounce powders i think i said that so next we have october and Hocus Pocus. And this has like orange, like it's it looks different from this orange. Let me get it on the swatch stick.
yes so this looks like it's a dark um a deeper more like metallic orange versus this just kind of like a flat orange and it has the black in here again yeah you can see the orange is the thing that's reflecting so it has black fine glitter black circular circular glitter orange circular hollow glitter and the uh hexagonal pieces again it has those next is hocus pocus which is also a movie and this is chocked full of glitter and it is like in my opinion of what i remember of in my opinion of what i remember of that movie this looks like hocus pocus to me Like it has the yellow, the orange, it looks like yellow to me, but it's like a lime green looking color. Uh, the black, the purple, the orange, like, I love this. And it again has the fine, it has the fine glitters in it, the circle glitters, that's like of a smaller size. And then the bigger pieces. This one is trick or treat. And it has orange, white, and black. But it's it's pretty much this one and this one the, without the blue. But it, and this one doesn't have. Oops, I hit it with the brush. But this one doesn't. This one doesn't have the um, red. So replace the red and put orange in it. Put this orange in it. So yes, yeah, very cute. And this is Trick or Treat. And I'm pretty sure, well, I don't wanna say I'm pretty sure, but she might be selling these, she might be selling these um, individually on her site. Look at this. Y'all, what is this? <laughs> Why did it pick up like that? That's what I'm talking about when it, like when I'm like, oh, it picks up a little weird for like the first couple ones. Like, this is absolutely stunning. And it's just red, hollow glitter. What I would have loved to see if she would have came out with um, a Freddy Krueger one, like red and green. That would have been very good, but that, it kind of airs like a little Christmassy, so I can understand the reason why not, but like his sweater is like iconic, I feel. Very cute, just red, different size glitters in here. And nothing wrong with that. So you can clearly tell her different collections because the lids are all different compared to her um, other ones, I guess would be the word. But there's, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's 10 acrylics in here three are shimmers which are like what i'm calling them shimmers but there's three shimmers which have for me to be called a shimmer it has to have like a color behind it and glitter with it and now for a color that is not in the collection this is called heavenly and it is a clear and like holographic not really holographic but iridescent is the word i'm looking for iridescent glitter acrylic this would be heavenly like on on like on a set like this would be like a really really good nail like This is gorgeous and it picks up 
very well and like look at this it has like the iridescent it has like the iridescent glitter that just fits so well it's not too chunky there is some chunkier pieces in it but like look it just looks so good Ugh. and this is like a perfect one to get even though this is not in the collection but really it's nine dollars it's cheaper than the other ones i believe maybe 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 not this is in the magical collection uh, no it's not in the magical collection anymore but this is just like the regular glitter and it is amazing like i love this i've I have like it's like her other glitters on here. Um, the, those other swatch videos will be linked to the cards. So this is kind of like a full like bomb nails video of me, and like in the cards, it'll have my pure my previous bomb nail swatches, bomb nail videos, bomb nail hauls, like all those. So this is heavenly, like, and it's just it's just gorgeous, and I feel like it would match any set you do you can do like a full glitter set like i love and i'm not really even like a glitter person if that makes sense but her glitters are very very gorgeous so first i'm going to show you the um colors with like a base behind them that aren't just pure glitter so this is halloween this one is Frankenstein. This black is Edward Scissorhands. This purple is Tiffany. And this is just, this is a true matte right here. And these I consider shimmers. So here is, so here is Boogeyman. Here is Elm Street. Here is Trick or Treat. Here is Hocus Pocus. Here is Scream. And here is and here is October. Finally, we have Heavenly, which is not in the bundle, but if you guys see this on her site, I do really recommend getting it. It's like a very good, like overall type thing. Um, and you can use this like any time of the year. Very good, would look very good on like some winter nails, um, make it like icicles, would be very good. So in total, I spent $109. Um, this kit right here, like the whole, like the, I think I said, so for 10 acrylics and this lovely nail art, and this, not these, oops, and this lovely nail art, it was um, $100, and then... So for the whole collection, it was $100. Then for this one um, Glitter Heavenly, it was $9. So that's why it was $109. This is very worth it um, to me. This is very gorgeous, gorgeous, like glamorous Halloween. It's not too, too scary. So yes, that was my little review. Um, again, her formula and consistency is the exact same. Whatever monomer you use will have um, an influence on the texture of these powders. But with the one I use, it's very smooth and very, very, very easy to use. I have no issues whatsoever when I swatch her powders or use her powders. Um, and I have a lot of bomb nails, if you guys know that. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, and ring the bell. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. By the way, before I exit out, links to her store will be in the description. Link to her channel will be in the cards. And yeah, that's it.